Hey guys, it's your watching because you want to know me. My name is AJ. Welcome back to another episode of Let's Build a Modular Castle. Last episode, we got this sort of entrance uh, yard, courtyard down and figured out with a lot of space left on the sides uh, for additions. I want a, a stable that we're going to be working on today and possibly a barracks on the opposite side. Let's turn the shaders off here. We don't want to have those on while building. I want the barracks on this side, and I want the stables on this side. Now, we don't have a huge amount of room in here. We are somewhat limited on space. Uh, but I think a car, uh, the, the, the stables here in, like, an L shape would be nice. I think I might take the detail away on the wall just to give us that extra block space and then add it in uh, afterwards. And then the pen that the horses can sort of have a little bit of grazing grass uh, in, I want to actually shape it to the uh, circle here. Instead of just having a normal, boring, square um, uh, sort of paddock. That's the word, isn't it? Paddock. So having a normal square paddock, uh, we instead uh, make it fit the area by just sort of making it round off. And I think fences will work great because we haven't got any fences. Well, we've only got fences underneath those little bushes there. We don't really have many fences here, so it should fit in quite nicely. Let's give ourselves a little bit of room. Have I got sound? There we go. <laughs> it was a, a very quiet for me. Oh, uh, every two. Is it that? Oh, no, that one. Okay, I'm just going to leave that one cobblestone there so I know where to put them back in uh, afterwards. And I think we might take away this one as well. Just like half of it, maybe. I think that'll be uh, a pretty good length. Now... For the material that we make it out of, I want to still blend it in with the castle. I want to make it look like the stable was built at the same time uh, the castle was. So we're going to have to use the stone and the stone bricks and everything for that. And the roof I want to keep the same as well. So we're going to be using the dark oak uh, for that. I don't want it to look like it was an addition afterwards. I want to make it look like it was all built in uh, together. So I think we'll start off with just stone. I might put some wood in the corners. We've got wood on there, so it's not going to look too out of place. Uh, we'll grab some logs. We'll keep it with the oak. And I think what we'll do is we'll have oak at the back and oak at the front. And that gives us four blocks in the middle. When that comes to the roof, is that a good thing or a bad thing? Probably a bad thing. We'll go to five blocks. So it's a seven block wide uh, total. And I think I want... I think I want the stables or, or like three would be nice. Three... Uh, areas for them to feed in uh, so that's in line with that one and this one doesn't need to be as wide it's just got to be wide enough or, or long enough deep enough uh, to get a horse in. so I think that should be deep enough and then we'll come out every two blocks is like the minimum to get a horse through three boxes comfortable now I would really have liked I'm gonna take this away as well I would really have liked to have uh, a very similar to stable to what we built in the zoo because it was such a beautiful um, uh, barn with like the stables on each side. We just don't have the room here uh, to be able to do that. You know what? It would be nice if we actually did bring this back in. You know, what? I'm going to leave that as four blocks because then it lines up really nicely with that. We sort of get that double uh, double log uh, in the corner. Okay, for the wall. What does stone look like next to log? I've never really used it. It looks a little bit weird. I might have to go with the stone bricks. It looked a little bit weird. Yeah, that definitely looks 100% better. Okay, so height-wise, we don't need to go terribly tall. We don't want to go anywhere near the height of the uh, main wall. We want the roof to actually start a block or so uh, underneath it. Uh, so we'll have this coming across the top. We need it at least three blocks high, though. Oh, not there. At least three blocks high because we need a door to be able to go underneath here. So if we had like a door, I could put a little window in there. I mean, why not? Maybe even a fenced window would be... Yeah, maybe a fenced window would be nice there. Fence and trap doors. Something like... Just something simple to start off with. We can add some little more detail afterwards. Uh, a nice door will go on there. And then the roof can start going back here. Now, we might be able to get another block of height here. If we get slabs, that's what we're going to do the roof out of here. And let's say we had the roof start here. We always like to overhang it by one block over the edge. 
And then we come up half a slab every time. Where do we end up? We end up quite nicely underneath there, but I think... I think maybe it'd be better if we had a little bit more height on this. Maybe the roof doesn't need to go back quite that urgently either. No, it actually looks pretty good like that. Uh, but I think I think we can go up by one more block. So we add another block. Here. Now that makes our window uh, the ability to be two blocks high, which I think always looks better than a one block high window. And we can replace this one with a... St oops with a stair. I like doing that. I don't know why. I don't know why I like doors like that. I just really do. That certainly looks like a better height. It's also going to give us much more room to get the horses under. We might be able to get a horse under and not bash our head <laughs> as we go through. That's uh, that's not something that we we want to be doing. All right, so we'll come up here and we still finish a block underneath, which is what we said. I said about a block underneath. All right, wonderful. Uh, we want these logs to go up here. There, 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 and there, oops, and there. What I might do is I might have the logs either along this level. I think when we're on a horse, I think we're actually above that height, aren't we? Now, we just want no normal vanilla horse. We, <laughs> we don't want no crazy horse. Oh, it spawned a baby. Oh, that's annoying. Ooh, oh, okay, I spawned a couple of babies. Oh, are you not fully grown? Oh, I need a... I have empty hand, don't I? I just want to see, can I get my head underneath it? Oh, I could. Okay, that's that's good then. Sword. I'm sorry, horses. <laughs> Cover your ears, guys, if you don't like it. Oh, also, oh, I'm just building this and killing these off. I do have a, a, a mini question of the day. Oh, he's so cute. Uh, I do have a mini question of the day. Has it yet snowed anywhere for you? Now, if you're in a location, if you're in a country where it's always snowing, uh, Canada or Sweden or somewhere like that, uh, then you probably don't need to answer this question. But if you live in a place uh, like England or something like that, I want to know, has it snowed for you yet? Have you had any snow? I haven't. I haven't had any snow. I'm not really bothered <laughs> by snow. Um, because I don't go anywhere too often. I don't have to drive to work. Uh, so snow doesn't really bother me in the sense of uh, it makes it harder for me to get places. However, I do like the snow. I like, although I don't, I don't have enough time to, I do like driving in the snow. I find it great fun driving in the snow. The roads are pretty empty because no one else wants to drive um, while the, the roads are like this, and, um, I, I don't mess about, that's the wrong, that's not the right word, that's not something that I should be saying, um, but I do like to have a little, I think it's okay to have a little bit of fun, isn't it, while driving along, spin the wheels, there. only in a safe, only in safe places, I don't like, <laughs> go up to a housing estate, with kids all around outside of school and start donutting. No, 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 no. But it's good fun to have a little... It is... It's nice to have a little bit of fun. I don't like that claim. It is nice to have a little bit of fun. Uh, but it, I haven't had no snow here yet. A lot of rain. And a little bit of frost. Um, but I must admit, we haven't really had... It, it's been cold, but it hasn't really been winter cold yet which is quite strange for the uk so yeah i'm interested to know if any of you guys in the uk um all the I suppose the states as well state do the states do does the states snow that often i don't think it does does it when i had um uh when my my fiance's um parents went to uh los uh, las vegas uh, a few weeks ago now last month sometime um she said that it was really hot there uh, and arizona they went to those, those two places uh they like lived or they stayed in arizona and then traveled down to las vegas for a little bit and uh they said it was like uh in i work in celsius because i'm in the uk it was about 30 uh, degrees celsius um most of the time and it never really dropped below 26 now if you <laughs> if you don't know what 
how hot that is, because uh, you work in Fahrenheit, uh, then you're going to have to convert it yourself. But pretty hot. In the UK here, we very rarely, even in the hottest of hottest summer days, uh, we very rarely go above sort of 26 degrees Celsius. Um, so we're definitely not the warmest country, but we always we always seem to have a very, very cold winter. But this year, it hasn't quite been it yet. It hasn't quite been as cold as what I thought. Anyway, whoops, we're sticking this roof on. I might add some... I've, I've got an idea about this roof. I like the roof. There's no problem with a roof like this. There's a problem that you might come across in a moment, which I'm going to show you, uh, to do with the logs. They're actually going to poke through the roof. But what I did to maybe make the roof look a little bit more interesting. I don't I don't know what block I'm going to use for it, but there's a potential for us to do a little bit of of work with this. Okay, this works out perfectly. I said that I wanted one block before the top of the wall, and it is so, so perfect. Oh, down here. Looking pretty cool on the map as well. Everything's looking pretty nice on the map. Uh, we need to work on, I think we might do it next episode, we need to work on the... Uh, mountain surra surrounding the castle, you know, the, the, the this hill that we sort of made everything on. Um, at the moment, it's just boring, dull grass. Um, we want to add some trees to that, some long grass. Make it look quite overgrown because nobody's going to care for it out there. Um, sugar cane and things like that. Okay, this looks really, really cool. I'm loving this. Uh, we'll take a row of these bushes. Uh, in a moment and make the little paddock sort of go around and follow the curve. We've only got a little bit of a curve, but it'll follow the curve. But the problem that we have is if we go on the inside here, obviously these logs will be fine. These logs will go up to here, uh, like that and that, and then in the middle, we'll just cover that up to make it look like it's all joined together. Okay. Uh, we'll go along to there. That one. And that one. Okay, so that's no problem. And this part joins up uh, without a problem as well. Uh, how did I do it over here? Ooh. Oh, let me through. Oh, I couldn't see the log over there. And at the back, I done that. No problem. I, <laughs> I should just leave all these open. Um, that one. That one. Oh, I don't need to worry. Well, that one. And slab goes in there. Okay, so that's option A. We can do it like that. It actually looks pretty neat on the inside. It looks, it doesn't really look like a problem. But there is another option we can do. We can actually put the logs here. Now, from the inside, this looks better. Okay, from the inside, that looks better because it looks like the logs actually go all the way up. But from the outside, you get these logs poking through. Now, some people might leave it like this. They might just go with, uh, might, might leave it like that. Or they might put the dark oak on top, like this. Uh, and go down as well, or uh, you might put these on top and make these pillars a little bit more of a feature. That works. I actually prefer that better than anything else so far. Uh, but another option that we have is to sort of do this, but then also continue it all the way down. So we do something like that. And I think that looks really cool. Not only are we sort of hiding up the um, the logs that I don't like to see uh, that much, uh, but we're also we're also adding more detail to the roof. So that one, oops, that one, so tricky. I should have really used full blocks and half slabs, but it doesn't matter. Make that one. And we might even be able to go on the opposite direction with this as well. Even though we don't need them, we could sort of do it as detail. So we can have it. There's three blocks in between. So it'll be up that one. Like that. And then three blocks up this one. Like that. Now, does it look pretty cool as it wraps around the corner? I think so. I think that, that looks a lot more interesting. You know, when you're down on the ground, think about the level that we're going to be looking at it at. I think that looks really, really cool. Okay, this bush can stay, but these bushes need to... That should go back to... Oops. Uh, that should go back to grass, but I'm going to speed the process up a little bit. Um, do we want to leave the striped lawn under here as hiccup as well? 
I don't think so. I think it might be... Oops. I think it might be best to make it grass. That could be striped. If we make it grass underneath where the paddock's going to be. We don't need it to be mowed in here. Who's going to mow it in there? That's what the horse is there for. They're for, they're for grazing on it. Do horses graze on grass? <laughs> when I, the more I think about it, the, the more I'm doubting myself. The cows graze on grass. I'm, I'm going to take these away, actually. I don't think horses... No, they must. Horses do. They go. Okay. So we'll have this sort of come out here. And then wrap around down to there. Makes it a little bit more of an interesting shape. Uh, I'd like a little bit more of a better entrance on here, though. So we're going to come up that one and that one. Make this the same height as the logs. I think that's a good height. Take those ones away. Replace these with the gates. So then we can get in and out. It looks a little bit more fancy. Uh, but the horses can't get out. Uh, not by themselves, uh, at least. Uh, maybe we should change that to uh, planks instead. And actually sort of have it. That one. That one. Whoops. Whoa, whoa, whoa. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. How am I going to do that? Like that. Oh, it's so hard getting it on top. There. Oh, yeah. That looks 100% better. Uh, what if we change those two logs as well? I don't like that as much. I thought I would, but no. Okay, so we put those ones back there. I'm going to speed the process up, put the big grass over there. Okay, that looks much better. Now, on the inside of the floor here, we obviously don't want it grass. We want a little bit more of a sturdy ground for them to be on. Uh, we don't want them to be, uh, the horses to be standing on, on wet grass and mud and stuff like that. Uh, so we're going to set it to some sort of stone, uh, cobblestone. Set to cobble makes a little bit more of a, of a sturdy thing I always like having these parts open we have them one and a half slab uh, one and a half block size so the horses can't get to each other but they can see each other and I think that's important to horses let's grab some tor torches or lamps because we do have lamps as well you know I'm gonna use the lamps if you haven't got the mod then you can obviously just use normal torches it really won't make a difference uh, let's cover this up Perfect, look at that. Oh, it looks so neat on the inside. Especially now that we've got those um, uh, planks there. It allows us to get that so clean. Okay. Uh, torch. Torch. Oh, lamp, lamp. We'll do them on the inside as well. Make sure there's a lot of light in here. And we'll put them on the outside uh, Oops, as well. I think that looks super, super neat, don't you? Oh, yes. Okay. Uh, horse. I don't need to tame them for me. You know what? We can have a baby one in there. I don't mind. Oh, and three different ones. Look at that. Three completely different patterns. I think that looks pretty cool. Um, you know what? It might be a good idea to tame them because if we tame them, uh, we can put the horse armor on them. At least on the two big ones. Okay. Uh, I'll tame them. I'll be back. All right. The black one, he tamed no problem. He was quite friendly. And I put the iron armor on him because I thought the silver would go really nice uh, with the black. And then on this one, I went with the gold. I think it looks superb. But he would not tame. He was an angry horse. I fed him a load of apples. I tried sugar on him. Apples seemed to work better. At least he tamed a little bit easier with apples. But he's a feisty one. He's a really feisty one. I think the gold on that one looks great. And I think the silver on that one looks great. That looks like more of a... Uh, a guard horse and this one looks more like a of a patrol horse that would sort of escort the king uh, to places and stuff like that that would be really cool okay door saw a door to go on here we don't have any other interesting doors unfortunately because uh, this is technically 1.7 uh, so we should have to do that. I could install Lasses Doors mod to get the screw stores and stuff back but it doesn't really matter all that much oh do we have that on the inside of this one we do. Do hmm. I didn't ever notice. Oh, if I change that to that. Okay, that looks neater. That's what we'll do on, on this side. We'll go there. Ooh. There. 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 Ooh, no, 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 no. And there. 
I can't take that one away. And the reason I can't take that one away is because that isn't in line with it. That's super annoying. Okay, what I'll do then is we'll add an extra block underneath like that. I can't do it there either. Okay, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. It doesn't need to be there. Uh, that one. That one. And I can put that one in there as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Put these up here. There's that room nicely, uh, nicely sorted. And then in here, I think we might as well make all of this into full blocks. That way we don't have, like, the random brick in there and stuff like that. So we'll have this along here as well. It's very, very dark in here. I'll get some light down in a moment, guys. And down here. Oh, and then on this side. Uh, how are we going to cover it on this side? I could put a ceiling down for in here. We'll put a ceiling down. That's how we'll solve that problem. There's always, there's always a loophole. There we go. Uh, lamps. What is the lamp for that? Lamp. Flame Wraith. Oh, L-A-M. I gotcha. Okay. That one and that one. That one and... Eh, that one. I think that looks pretty neat. Oh, and then on the inside of these as well, I forgot. We need one cauldron and one hay bale per, uh, per place. But we want to make sure we do it in a spot, oops, that a horse cannot get out of. Uh, oh, and water, obviously. So this one's easy, because we can have it sort of like there and there, and then the horse can't get over. These are going to be a little bit trickier. I don't think that the horse is going to be that clever. I mean, if I'd done that with the horse, the horse is going to so definitely do that, isn't it? Okay, we'll put the... We'll put the hay in the ground then. That's how we'll do it. We'll do it the same on this one so it all matches. We'll have them facing up. So it looks like a, a little bit of a comfy bed. They can sort of pick the straw up off the floor. And on this one. I don't think that that cauldron in the middle one. Like I don't think the horse is going to like mess with it too much. Alright then. I, think like, I don't think that he's going to, like, get up and jump onto there. I think that's a little bit too much for him. All right. Uh, in here, though, we want a nice... Uh, I might go with cobblestone base still in here. And the same in this room. And I think what we want is we want one room for, like, a storeroom and one room for um, the stable master to live. So this will almost be like... Uh, it's house. I think that one should be like a miniature house. This one should be the storeroom. So we shall put And that way he doesn't have to like drag Hey, if we had the storeroom in there and this is his house He'd have to drag like hay through his through his house and on his bed. That would be itchy Okay, I like these facing in oops, different directions. I think it looks a lot better. Yeah, like that um, Maybe some chests in here. They would have things like you know uh, the leads and stuff like that to be able to carry them. Let's do a double one like that. I think that's probably all that we need in here. I'm going to move that up by one block. What else would would you have? I mean, you could have shelves and stuff like that, but... Uh, I've got shelves. I can actually just put shelves down. Uh, but if you guys don't have shelves, which you uh, most likely don't, then you just use carpet and string and it'll do the same thing. Like that. Yeah, I think that finishes it off nicely. Okay, uh, in this little room, obviously if it's his house, he's going to need a bed. Bink. He's going to need a furnace. I might make a little chimney as well that goes up. That could be pretty cool. Like if we had that going up here. And we made that into like a chimney block. How would we do that? Just with fen uh, walls maybe? Like if we had the wall come up above there and go through hmm, if I make that like that I think that it doesn't look too bad like that oops I don't think it looks too bad like that and then on the outside I don't know what block it is I'm gonna guess that one uh, it is that one no nope, it was that one okay uh
I think that looks pretty neat, right? I think that looks pretty tidy. Uh, so he's got a li nice little furnace there. Uh, he's going to need some sort of work surface. Uh, it's not an expensive place, so we don't want to use, like, uh, clay-looking blocks, stuff like that. I think we'll double up these slabs to make a little bit of a work surface unit there. Uh, some storage chests for clothes and tunics and stuff like that. It'd be tunics in these days. We'll put a nice double one in the corner. We'll get some shelves and shower and things like that. I don't think that is going to be that important here. Uh, so I'm just going to put a couple of shelves down. Uh, maybe a little bit of carpet over the top. If we use brown, it might look like a, like a little wooden sort of style top. I think that looks pretty neat. We don't need much more than that. Um, carpet, we'll get some nice grey carpet. Dark grey, I think dark grey. As a little rug on the floor. Paintings, I suppose we can have as well. Yeah. Uh, and it's really a shame that that goes like like we can see the sky. What if we made that block right there into a slab? I think we need a slab on the outside as well. That I think that's better. Then we don't have the hole. It looks good from the top. It looks better from the bottom, right? I think that looks better. Okay, and I think that's going to do it. I think that's sort of the stable. Oh, we'll stick a door on here. Give him a little bit of privacy. Uh, I want the door on. Oops. No, 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 no. Oh, door. On there. He's got a little bit of privacy then. Beautiful. I think that's pretty nice, don't you? Let's take a quick look with the shaders on. And then we're going to have to end up the episode, guys. If you enjoyed it, then hit that like button. I really do appreciate it. If you haven't already, then feel free to subscribe. Oh, hit done, of course. And we shall see you in the next episode uh let's make the sun go over there hold on time set seven thousand a little bit more eight thousand just like in between there there we go look oh yes